Hey, Anel, I just got back from taking my mom out to lunch. The waiter at the end of the meal brought her the check. Can you confirm that the waiter is in the wrong? Is it possible that you simply didn't project um, authority while you were eating? Here's what I always think, okay? I think if I were a server, there's a you gotta look at a couple of data points while you're serving. And I've never been a server, so this is just completely projecting, okay? But if it's like two middle-aged adults and a 10-year-old eating dinner, you're like, you give the, the bill to the parents, okay? But if it's, a, if it's a couple of adults eating, you see who's driving the bus during the ordering process. So if, if it's me and my wife, and then, let me put it this way, if we order an appetizer and then we each order an entree, whoever orders, whoever says the appetizer is the team captain for the table. So that's the person that I would first pantomime giving the bill to, and then they could pass it to the other person if they want. But they've chosen to be the group leader because they ordered something for the table. So I don't know, if, if you took your mom out to dinner and she said, we'll start with the loaded baked potato skins and then I'll have the pasta primavera and then you were like, I'll have the Jack Daniels apple wood bacon smoked brisket burger, then I can understand why the waiter would be like, because I think the, the person who ordered the appetizer is they've, they've chosen the mantle of responsibility. They can always delegate the bill to whoever they want afterwards or whoever wants it. Does the waiter ever give Kate the bill? Yeah, I mean, sometimes. The, the, but the, it, I don't think it's sexism either way. What is maybe not sexist, but is always funny to me is like oftentimes when we go out, Kate will order like a cheeseburger and curly fries and then I'll order like, hey, can I get the, um, the Mexican salad bowl with extra halloumi? And then... Inevitably, if the server isn't running it to the table, if it's like someone that's just bussing that didn't take the order in the first place, they always give me the cheeseburger and the fries and give her the salad. Which I understand. It's perhaps a, a safe assumption to make, but... It happens all the time. I'm like, I'm not like other guys. I, I eat a salad at a restaurant sometimes. You ever bus tables? Listen, I'm not trying to insult the bussers. I'm just making an observation, okay? Because the next question is, I know is going to be like, do you know how effing hard it is? I, I, I'm sure it is. I'm just, <laughs> I was just asking a question. I was just, okay. I was just making an observation as well. That's on the busser. They can just ask. I don't know. It's okay. They just put the plates there and then we politely wait for them to leave and then we swap the plates. They're serving for real. They are serving Mexican salad bowl vibes right now. Can I tell you as well, originally I wanted the bit to be a green goddess salad bowl, but then I knew that some lore master was gonna be like, oh, excuse me, you said you've never had green goddess uh, dressing before, so what are we expected to be uh, believe here? Thoughts on green goddess dressing? I feel like it appeared overnight and now I have no idea. Like I never asked what it was and now I'm too afraid to order something with green goddess dressing. I used to get a, a juice sometimes at like a smoothie place that was called Green Goddess. And then they started coming out with the Green Goddess uh, dressing and sauce. And I'm like, I don't even know what this is. It's Caesar, but no parm, but lots of herbs. I like that. I could be into that. Now they got it at Subway, but I don't have to go to Subway anymore because I'll just go to La Grata del Formaggio. Um, but the truth is that like, it was a month ago when I said I never had green goddess dressing. And then like five days after that, I got a green goddess like quinoa bowl and just ate it and was like, huh, so that's what green goddess is like, but didn't think that it was like noteworthy enough to bring up on the stream. So I was like, we haven't done the required world building for me to bring that up yet without being like, um, you know, melvined into, <laughs> into oblivion here. Don't try me, mister. What is green goddess dressing? I don't know. It's kind of like a... It's like a herby vinaigrette. It's just like another salad dressing. Like it's not, it's not that big of a deal. It was good, don't get me wrong, but the star of the show was the halloumi. 